All right, what's up, guys? Afflicted Gamer here, back in another Division video. Yep, the Division. I know that it has been a while since I put anything up on the channel Division related, but that's for the mere fact that, well, for console users like myself, there's just not much to do. The PC players get to do the public test servers and try new things out, you know, and kind of contribute to what the game is going to be like when the patch drops, the 1.4 patch. So, yeah, there's just nothing to do. You know, the new expansion, the new DLC for Destiny is here. There's other games to play. So, all of that is new versus me doing what? Leveling up another character? No, no thanks. Um, the Division is a game I love. Don't get me wrong. I'm not hating on it, but there's just nothing to do. However, supply drops are inbound for those of you that do own the Season Pass. So, here's your friendly reminder to go get them. And also just my thoughts and a little bit of advice that you can choose or choose not to take. And that is to save your sealed caches. When 1.4 drops, everything in this game is going to change. Things like skill power will no longer come from your mask, your backpack. They're going to come from electronics. There are going to be world tiers, 1, 2, 3, and 4, you know, for to select your difficulty. Gear sets are going to have new set bonuses so many things are going to change your weapon talents your the way you can mod your gear and guns and everything is going to change so in the meantime you might as well save these things and for those of you that are still trying to make that perfect build guys in a few weeks that perfect build is most likely going to be irrelevant or close to because massive is doing a complete overhaul you know so my recommendation is to wait. I say wait, see what they do with the game, see how the world functions, see what the, how the new gear sets, well not the new ones, but the ones we have, but with the new, the new 2, 3, and 4 set bonuses, see how they all work, see which ones fit together best now, because everything's going to be different. Quickly, a little side note, you see me moving around a lot, and that's because the controls felt so foreign to me, it was crazy. Also, I'm doing this on my PlayStation 4, where my character is not min-max like he is on Xbox One, so I'm just kind of moving around. He's not in terrible shape, he's just not in as good of shape right now as the Xbox character. And the two friends that joined on the second supply drop, which is not in this video, sorry guys, I was just logging in to get it before I forgot. <laughs> so, there was nothing for me to say in here and do. Like I said, there are other games out with a lot of stuff to do right now. But, anyway, when 1.4 gets here, I'm really curious to see what Massive has done and, you know, everybody that contributed to it and everybody that's been doing the you know the public test servers and all that I'm really curious to see what is gonna happen I hope that the game is gonna be a lot better than how it was I mean I love the division honestly I miss playing the division but there's just nothing to do and I'm not gonna go and grind for gear that I'm gonna have to change in a couple of weeks so I'm just trying to save you guys that trouble unless you are fresh and new to the game then welcome it's a fantastic game enjoy leveling up just you know when it comes to min maxing i would wait until 1.4 gets here and then perfect your build from there save your sealed caches the gear score is going to drop down to 229 from 268 so you know make those changes when we get the patch so that's it for me guys thanks for your time if you enjoyed the video drop a like if you are new consider subscribing because when the division patch drops i will be back in the game full time all right have a good day thanks for watching and i will see you in the next one